Is the caller there? Yes. Go ahead. Before there was The View or Oprah, there was Donahue. Where are our values here? For almost 30 years, Phil Donahue led a lively, informative daytime talk show. Long a feminist rather than recipes and gossip, he elevated the genre to issues. We grew up with the gay rights movement. We grew up with the anti-war movement. No subject was off limits. Do you feel that discussions of sex might be useful and positive and help promote yes. a healthy society? Or at the end, too salacious. Well, it's more competitive. As the syndicated show moved from Dayton, Ohio, to Chicago, to New York, Donahue was the first to let his audience ask questions. Our radical idea was called democracy. Yet it was his incisive probing and energy that made him the king of daytime talk, earning 20 Emmy Awards and a Peabody. Tonight, Winfrey posting there would not have been an Oprah show without him. Donahue moved to cable but never duplicated his success. President Biden, who awarded Donahue the Medal of Freedom. From Irish Catholic roots in Cleveland, Phil Donahue rose to transform television. Today called him an icon. A father of five, Donahue married twice, including 44 years to actress Marlo Thomas. The most important moment is that first moment. I mean, it certainly was with me when I walked in the green room on the day that she was a guest. A television pioneer who got America talking. Ann Thompson, NBC News. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.